we tend to send out our grounded pilots on these sorts of rescue operations, keep them occupied until they get back in the air. The captain, whom you will be accompanying, has been briefed. He is a, a rather unorthodox chap. You'll have plenty of time to ask him that yourself, my dear. That's him? Yes, my dear. Don't be alarmed. She will be accompanying you on your mission. Thought I was going along. Yes, well, we received orders requesting that someone with medical training accompany you. If our man is out there alive, Eleanor here will be more than capable of attending to his medical needs. Great. Eleanor is fluent in German, so she will be acting as your interpreter. Yeah. You were very lucky that she was available. So be a nice chap and take good care of her. You drive. Yes, sir. Captain? Eleanor? Grab those, will you? Surely you're not serious. Captain? <gasps> Captain!
for stopping? You know anything about navigating? No, not much. Not much or nothing at all? Nothing. All right, look here. You see this? Mm-hmm. That's where we are. You see this? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's where they think he is. So we're gonna drive in a straight line, 114 miles, that way, north by northeast. You see this compass? That's north by northeast, okay? And we also need to keep track of our speed and we need to watch our hours. So it's 1900 right now. And we're here, okay? At 2000, we work out distance equals speed over time. You understand that? Yes, sir. Okay, that's how we calculate.